Young mothers distracted by their children have become the key target for a pair of purse snatchers working local grocery store parking lots. Thanks for joining us. I'm Robin Nance. A KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey is live on 29th Avenue with what you need to know about this series of crimes. Jeff. And Robin, this criminal couple uses a variety of tactics to separate shoppers from their purses. It's happened at least twice here in the parking lot at this South Hill Safeway. And police are worried if it keeps up, someone is going to get hurt. The suspects are apparently spending a lot of time staking out busy shoppers. Kim Yaney spotted the couple sitting in their car and thought they looked suspicious. They looked as though they were waiting for somebody in the grocery store and when I came back out about a half an hour later, they were still sitting there and I thought it was a little strange. Police say the pair wait until a woman starts loading her groceries into her car and while her back is turned, the female suspect snatches her purse. In Yaney's case, the male distracted her by offering to help lift a heavy bag of dog food. He asked me if I wanted help getting it, you know, putting it, it into the car, and I said, no, thank you. And um, as I did that out of the corner of my eye, I see a girl running, and I didn't think anything of it. And I get in my car, I turn it on, and I looked over at my seat, and my purse was gone. In a different incident, the couple waited until a woman was moving her child into a car seat and then grabbed her purse out of her shopping cart. There was also a drive-by purse snatching, and the victim was dragged until the strap around her arm broke free. It seemed like they had a thing going, like a scam going. Like enough people must leave their items in a cart or are distracted long enough that they can work together and do that. And I just could not believe it happened to me. And many stores like Safeway have baggers that will take your groceries to your car for you if you're shopping alone or juggling an armful of kids. Having a second second of eyes around may make your purse a less attractive target to thieves. By the way, these purse snatchings also happening on the north side, particularly at the Fred Myers on Francis. Reporting live on the South Hill, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.